Hi everyone. Today is Sunday, September twenty fifth, two thousand and sixteen. And you see the V for the fifth age and the fifth angel coming right there. This right here represents the end of the time of the dog and the end of the time of grace and mercy. And that time approaches. See breaking bad, because breaking stuff is bad. <clears throat> and taking drugs is bad. So that's a satanic thing to do. <clears throat> so yeah, like. See, the woman of the Bible, and Peggy Carter, they both know their value. Because Peggy Carter represents the woman of the Bible, the woman of Revelation 12. See, that's even the eagle that's granted to her. So Peggy Carter represents that woman right there. See how Peggy Carter even has the same hair colour as her. So yeah, like... <clears throat> um, she's wearing a green dress hair, isn't she? Just like Sienna in Hollyoaks wears a green dress in the, in the new Hollyoaks title sequence for 2016. Because... But Sienna, Anna Passy, and Hayley Atwell, Agent Carter, they they all represent the woman of Revelation 12, the heavenly woman, the woman of the Bible. Their breasts even represent two domes and nuclear power plants. <clears throat> like, See, this here represents just like Umbrella Corp in Resident Evil. And even just like the, the symbols that the, that the Pope wears on his tunic or robes or whatever you want to call his clothing. <clears throat> it also represents the will of the Great Tribulation, this. See, even the red for Satan and even like Iron Man wears red and yellow armor as well. Even the white for heaven as well. So, <clears throat> see, she's wearing blue for Israel, Jacob, and Jesus. See, Vivitar, just like the V for the fifth age and the fifth angel. Eye twist, just like Illuminati and the Eye of Horus. <clears throat> see, 70, just like the 7-7 seven, seven bombings and such. And 2017 coming. <clears throat> And then, basically, Hayley Atwell's souls represent when this woman gives birth to our immortal souls. When we are born into our new immortal bodies. This woman's even barefoot stuck on this moon. Just like Hayley Atwell's barefoot here. So, yeah, like, <clears throat> look at this. X Factor 2016, the manipulation is unbearable. Unbearable has got to do with the feet of a bear. 14 hours ago for the fourth age that we're wearing at the moment. Like, see, manipulation, just like Obama is manipulating the whole world and he will betray all of us. He's manipulating all of these people and all of these nations and such and he's just going to nuke everything. <clears throat> like look we have to prepare for every weather condition because every weather condition will be at the ends of days <clears throat> and it's typical that this girl is wearing a panda dress or skirt <clears throat> that represents the feet of a bear in the bible Right when a gay act is performing. Because it, it, it represents the gayness is rising up. That's why um, the gay act gets through to judges' houses. Instead of, uh, instead of certain straight people.
that he's called James, just like the King James Bible. But also, there's another contestant on this year's X Factor called James, who represents Jesus. So this James right here is on the side of Satan. <coughs> but the James that represents Jesus, and who looks like Jesus, <coughs> he is on the side of... He is on the side of Jesus Christ. <clears throat> so, and and he's on the and and the other James, not this James, um, <clears throat> is on the side of the Christians. Like, <clears throat> see, his name is Melvin O. Doom, and he represents Obama because Obama brings doom. O oh, Doom, Doom. Goes all the way back to the, the Doom video games. Obviously, you see the 666 there that will be covered in the last video. <clears throat> see this right here? The red and yellow for Satan and Iron Man. And then the blue for Israel, Jacob, and Jesus. Even this flash thing has the red and yellow for Satan and Iron Man. Even that white for heaven there. <clears throat> and even the black for the darkness with Isis and Batman and such. So, yeah, like, Wonder Woman represents the woman of Revelation 12 as well. Just like Hayley Atwell and Agent Carter do. <clears throat> so, Gal Gadot represents the woman of Revelation 12 as well. Because <clears throat> remember, like Russia, Germany, China, North Korea, they're trying to take down Israel, and Gal is from Israel. <clears throat> See, this shield represents just like Captain America's shield. See, the things that she's wearing on her arms represent just like what Hayley Atwell's wearing on her arm right here. <clears throat> so, who knows, the end times might be done in a flash, or it might be done slowly. We don't know. And finally, Melvin O'Dean shows that he's wearing a green sock. Um, in this one episode of Strictly Come Dancing right here. Now, for those who don't know, green represents Islam rising. <clears throat> even this UFO might show up. Who knows? This guy even has the mark of the beast. <clears throat> and then all of the nations are blended together with this flag and, and all religions as well. And the type of the red coming and rising. <clears throat> is almost upon us, if it hasn't started already. Thank you very much, everybody. I'll see you all at the wedding feast of the Lamb, and keep faith in Jesus Christ. May God have mercy on us all. Hallelujah. God bless. Jesus brings love. See the love right there? And the hugs and such? <clears throat>